Hey everyone! Welcome back. I am back today with more Hunter Hunter, you guys. I am so excited to see what we are getting into next um, in these next few episodes. If you're joining me early today, you already know what that means. It means you are one of my awesome patrons. Thank you so much, and as always, I am sending up those big old hugs right through that screen. And if not, still thank you for joining me today. I'm glad you're here. I do hope you'll consider supporting me that way. The link to my Patreon is going to be in the description down below. So, all right, guys, as if we hadn't built up enough world building with just the concept of a hunter, the concept of this whole world with the hunter exam and how that works and everything, we're now getting into a totally different world beyond the hunter exam or you know asterisk next to that with like it's technically still going on but um i am so impressed by how now we're venturing into the world of martial arts and we're learning all about these new schools of thought techniques skills everything um and i like how like at the beginning of the last episode there was enough world building just involved and like how the tower works. Now we're going to go ahead and throw in like some martial arts training on top of it. I feel like we're just like in a whole new world. I'm really, really enjoying it and curious to see uh, where we're going with it. Because where we started um, last episode, they were just kind of like, it's kind of like exciting that they're starting off like totally broke just like blank slates and working their way up and we have Killua kind of narrating the experience from his um his previous experience which was being trapped off there as a small kindergarten age child <sighs> my poor baby but we had him narrating the experience but we're we're gonna pretty quickly come up on, you know, just total new territory. Um, especially now that he decided, like, now it's not just like, let's get cash and see how far we could go. It's like, oh, we're going to the top. And going was like, I was always going to the top, but okay. <laughs> going was just like, going will accept nothing less. Um, and, and I would expect nothing less from Gone, to be honest. Uh, Killua, on the other hand, like we know when he was left there, he's like, ah, I just stopped at 200 because that's all I had to do. Um, I get the idea that um, Gone is really driven to always be pushing his potential. Killua, I feel like, has worked so hard just to push against the idea that all he's doing in life is just training to kill people. That I don't think he's ever really been allowed to honestly explore his potential just for his own, just out of his own will. You know what I mean? So this is kind of like new territory for Killua as well. Um, we met some new characters. I'm really liking them so far. It's fun to kind of like just be building a whole other story. And it's going to be so crazy when we meet back up with Kurapika and Leorio and... Uh, just like catching them up on our adventures. And I'm sure they'll be having adventures too. I don't know if we're going to get to see, like, are we going to jump around and follow different people at different times? Or are we just going to find out when they all get back together? Um, I don't know, you guys, but there's only one way to find out. And that is to jump right in to the next episode of Hunter Hunter. Let's do this. Burn your own soul. Oh, so kind of like that last phase of the exam. Oh, focus. Okay. Okay, all right. Express yourself. Ah. So it's all like working on your willpower. Okay, yes, yeah. so let's have let's let's have a a lesson. It, yes, you know, no one's nervous in this room. Oh wow oh I see. He has like an aura. Oh whoa. It is it is a tangible thing. 
Like we're talking about willpower, but willpower is something you can see. Oh, Kel Kelowas. Oh boy. Wow. Okay. So that is a He was lying? Oh, I see. Could that be because of the strength of his soul, though? I mean, could that just have to do with willpower, though? Maybe not. Oh. Huh. Is there something else? Maybe there is, guys. Maybe there is. They did. They were pretty tricky with the way they. Hmm. Oh, okay, it is a lie. It is a lie. Okay. Oh, force. Okay. Oh, okay. So he couldn't tell them, tell them, but he. What's gonna happen to the soda cans? What are we doing? Uh oh, uh oh. Those soda cans are history. Oh, he turned it into like a razor. Oh! Dang, well, that's a waste of soda. Mm, so he couldn't tell them all about it. Okay. Oh, you owe him a new book. Oh, his juice. You better make this right, sir. So they're at the 190th floor now. Oh, that kind of looks like the mom's visor, doesn't it? Hey, Go doesn't look worried. He's like, bring it. I've dealt with plenty of things that bite before. Oh, this guy's kind of got like an 80s wrestler thing going on. I like it. He's he's pretty ripped, but that doesn't mean he's the uh, killer. Was like, God, I'm bored. Oh. Oh. Oh dear. Uh, killer was just bored now. He's like genuinely disappointed. <laughs> But can you imagine how powerful, like, Hisoka and the brother and all that must be? If, like, this is how strong Gon and Killua are? That's crazy. Have no choice. But what? Is he going to take them on as students? Uh-oh. What's happening? Oh, no. This looks very ominous. What is going on? What happened to the fancy, nice place? What is happening? They're just, oh, and they're playing the music, you guys. Oh, they're stuck. Son of a gun. Murderous intent. Oh. Is this how you greet everyone? What? Why not? Oh, I see. So where it's a whole different world from the 200s on. <gasps> that feels an awful lot like... Oh, no! <laughs> I saw the playing card. I should have known. 
Was that where the murderous intent is? Oh, no. Thank you. That's where the murderous intent was coming from, perhaps. He's probably waiting for you guys. He knows why. And here comes the music. Oh, he was able to track. Oh my, so Hisoka is actually quite intelligent as well. Like he's quite capable. He's a veteran, of course he is, of course he is. Oh, dang. No, yeah, they're not going to turn around. How else are they going to train and get stronger? No. Oh, dear Lord. What even is he doing? Don't tell me he knows all these techniques as well or something. <gasps> he showed up to help them? That's why. No, he knows all of the techniques. That's how unprepared they are. Mm. He was lying before. He is no longer lying. He was leaving out some critical things. He's gonna, he's like, I have no choice but to take them on as students. Okay. Okay. I see. Ah. Uh, so he won't be able to make it to the top. Oh, can you teach them everything they need to know in like how many, however many hours they have left now? Well, let's see, 20, so that would be 8 o'clock. Oh, I think. Got it. Life energy. Got it. 10. Oh. Nullifies your oh, so in other words, you can mask your yeah, which is what which is what Killua was saying. Like the stronger you get, the more you can mask your presence. Huh. Yeah, it's like tangible. You can see it. Well, not from him. It doesn't. But maybe from someone like Hisoka would. Okay, so yeah, so they're off to a good start. They have good senses. Oh, I wonder who's been doing that. Okay. Block the aura with your aura. Okay. Otherwise, you'll die? Oh, that will happen to you. Yes, you will die. Yes, true, Nen. Oh, my God. Oh, you. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, Hunterpedia, I almost forgot. Hi, Gold. Hi, Killua. Hi, cuties. Hi, Wingsong. 
Shingen Ryu. But it's sh but he's not he's not good with the shirt though. Oh guys, all right. So so far, the impression I'm getting from Wing is that he's like <sighs> he his alignment is like good. You know, like neutral good. <laughs> it's his alignment. Like he he um does not want these techniques to be used for anything negative. It seems now, I wonder if maybe that's because Hisoka was a student of his or a student of this um, uh, concept, at least. I don't know if maybe he personally trained him. He seems pretty young to have trained Hisoka, but he did mention something about being able to control your age. So I wonder if, like, is he really, like, a 20-something as he appears to be? He's super cute, actually. I really, I really like his style. Um... But that's neither here nor there. Right now, let's let's talk about... So we learn more about these four concepts. And yes, they did have to do with willpower. However, there was some lying by omission here about how specifically they're used and how even like um, a concept like... Was it, was it Nen that he gave the example of that you could um, turn something into like a very dangerous weapon? Um, so you have to be very, very careful who you teach these concepts to. Um, so basically they're students now. They're, they're students. Now, I imagined if he was going to take them on as students that they would kind of like take a break and go and do this for say maybe like a month or six weeks or, or longer possibly. No, guys, we gotta, okay, let me think about this. It's military time, right? It's 20 hours. Um, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 8. 8 o'clock. It's 8 o'clock. It's a little after 8. They have till midnight. In less than four hours, can they master these techniques? I think they can. But boy, what a way to put a time limit on it. And it makes total sense. It's really cool that, like, the... The um, fact that Killua has already been through once before and didn't go past this point is it's a nice callback to like, okay, well, that's going to be a problem. Like, you're not going to get be able to get past again. So, like, they're going to have their cake and eat it, too. They're going to learn this technique and they're going to get through. I love it. I absolutely love it. I know if anyone can do it, it's them. Um, so this whole thing was to train to get stronger to face Hisoka, right? Who would have thought Hisoka was going to show up? And honestly, like, I guess I should have seen it coming that if this is such a, uh, especially when she said past this point, you do it all for the glory. There's no more money. I should have known that someone like Hisoka would be like a veteran of this place. Um, good thing they went there, huh? To train to fight him. Um, it, it seems like they're going to have to be good enough to get to the top in order to, uh, in order to even face him. I'm, I'm guessing he has been all the way to the top. Unless he's like in the 200s. I don't know. Uh, maybe he's just in the 200s and he's just guarding the 200s. But the assumption I made, could be totally wrong, was that he had reached the top and he was like a veteran of, of the whole tower. I could be wrong though. Uh, that might be wrong. <sighs> well, it is no wonder that Nen or Ren or whatever seemed very familiar and was something that we had seen Alumi use because it seems like some of the um, best and also deadliest individuals know these concepts. Um, it, it really does, it really does make you kind of respect Wing's decision to screen a little bit. <laughs> I don't know who it was who taught them, but clearly they should have screened the applicants a little bit better. But so the only way to fight, the only way to fight it is by using it. Um, I know they can do it. I know they can do it. I have, I have like no doubts right now. Like I know they're kind of teasing, like, can they learn it in four hours? And uh, maybe they'll surprise me and they'll be like, no, they didn't learn how to use it. They found a way around it like they did with smashing down the walls in that one part of the exam. Um, but I got to say, after all we've been through with them, I just there's like I have 
like no doubt that they're just gonna come through this and be fine and be able to learn it in four hours like I think I just like believe in them so much now that like it would not surprise me at all so all right guys well that was that was that was quite an episode did not expect to see Hisoka again so soon oh it is always um not a pleasure to see him yet it is always like entertaining in its own way I think you guys get it um so all right guys here we go um we're going to master some new concepts then we have to get past Ahsoka. Then we have to, because it seems like the 200s are a whole different world. Whole different world. Then we have to worry about that. So we got we got a ways to go, guys. Um, I loved that. What an intense episode. I hope you enjoyed watching along with me. As always, thank you so much for joining me today. Please be sure to join me next time. We will watch it, get through it, figure it out. All of the above together. Bye for now, guys.